Hi there. You're in the live with your mate JJ. Um, I uh, I got a comment uh, on uh, on the first uh, uh, mini project that I did just recently, the the symbol keyboard, and uh, uh, the person uh, gave me some suggestions for debugging the um, the touch screen problem that that we've been having. So uh, that's really excellent. Uh, thank you to that person for that. Um, I'm gonna uh, make another video soon uh, doing the the debugging of that project. Um, so stand by for that. Probably be a little while. I've got a whole lot of things going on at the moment. Today I just wanted to do a very quick mail call video. So this is a mail call video. I'm just going to show you some of the stuff that has arrived in the post recently um, from Amazon and AliExpress. Just a few little odds and ends. Nothing really terribly exciting but uh, yeah I'll show you what I got in this video and then I'll have a few more videos coming out soon so uh, let's pop over to the bench and have a look what's arrived <clears throat> well here we are on the bench so uh, let's have a look at what came from Amazon first uh, what is this ah uh, yes these arrived today uh, Amazon was really good about this I, I ordered these back in uh, December 2023 so, you know, approaching a year ago, t nine or ten months ago, um, they're just uh, little um, uh, screwdrivers for uh, working particularly with um, uh, uh, gaming consoles. Um, and I, I got uh, a bunch of them. I got um, these ones, uh, which actually arrived. They're like little secure bits for opening like Nintendos and gaming consoles of various descriptions um, and related to those are these it's actually just one micro Phillips head and uh, and and what they call a Y driver it's like a tri point thing um, and sometimes they're called tri wings and sometimes they're called tri points but um, people don't use the terms correctly so you're never quite sure what you're dealing with but uh, it's a three pronged doodad for working with gaming consoles so that's pretty cool um, and yeah the good thing is I just I, I, I let Amazon know that because uh, I ordered it ages ago it never showed up and I, I got in contact I said hey these never showed up and they said no problem we'll send you some new ones so very uh, very good of Amazon to do that for me um, so uh, very happy about that uh, let's see what else came from Amazon I have two things from Amazon <coughs> um, so let's see what we've got in the box electro cookie Mini 50p black. What do you reckon this is? Honestly, I bought all this stuff ages ago, um, and I I completely forgot what I ordered. Oh, it's circuit boards. Excellent. Yes, I was very pleased. I I finally found uh, some good uh, looking um, prototyping boards that weren't like ex insanely expensive. I don't I don't want to spend like five dollars on a board for like a, a project. I want to spend like fifty cents on a board for a project. And these electro cookies, they fit the bill. I'll have to put a link to these in the description of the video in the show notes because uh, these things look at them. Don't they look just great? Check it out. Um, so these ones are packs of uh, various sizes. Uh, these are some bigger ones over here um, and then we've got uh, a whole bunch of mini ones isn't that just cool I think that's really cool <sighs> let's pop out a mini one and I'll just show you uh, why I think it's good stuff packaging's pretty good too I have to say ah oh, it's a bag that's amazing There we go. So, let's pull one of these guys out. Yeah, it's just what I wanted. So you see that the um, the the on this side they they're not connected, uh, but they're but they are connected on the bottom, which is just perfect, perfect, perfect. I'll show you why I didn't like the ones that I've got. <coughs> You see, originally I went shopping for what I could find on AliExpress and I got myself all of this stuff. Um, this stuff here is actually just uh, thermal pads. That's thermal gear. That's separate. Um, but these are the ones... These are thermal stuff as well. But these are... Uh, and that's more thermal stuff, but we can leave that there. So you look at these ones, this proto board, the tracks aren't, aren't joined anywhere. Like, 
you know, so you, so the, the tracks aren't joined, so you have to put it in and you have to point to point it and um, it's just, it's nasty. And they're all like that, like these are like that, you know, just no joined tracks, which I, I really didn't like. So I got all of these boards because that was really all that was available. Oh, there was, this stuff wasn't so bad, but you see, it's just too much. And I, I did actually get a tool for working with this. It's a, it's this thing here. It's a screwdriver it's this kind of thing. It's got a, a protective bit of plastic, but what you can do is you can put it in like there and then give it a twist and it'll rip out the, uh, the, the line on the proto board. So you can actually use these to make your own, you know, variable things. Um, so these ones, in my view, are, are, are coupled with this tool, are better than these ones. But these ones that I found <laughs> on Amazon the other day, they're the best of all. They're just best of all. I, I mean, I think they are. I haven't used them yet, but don't they look great? I think they look great. That's perfect. And look how many I've got. So I, I can make projects for the rest of my life. Um, on these little on these little guys so I, I want to make a little so good work electric cookie I'm a, I'm a huge fan I was so happy I found those um, so yeah I'm real pleased about that very pleased indeed now I'll just have to get it all out of the way so we can get on with the unboxings <sighs> nice work electro cookie and, 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 and those those first two things there, that was from Amazon. Now, the rest of the stuff here is from AliExpress. So, uh, let's see what came from China. Uh, yes. So, uh, these are like nylon uh, abrasive uh, um, things for the, for the rotary tool. So, uh, yes, very nice. Just a uh, mild abrasive. You, you, you put it into the rotary tool and then you can scrub a dub dub different colors I don't know if the colors are correlated with um, grit or anything like that hard to say I, I would assume not I don't think um, that's a that's a grit thing I wonder if we could fit them all in one container that'd be a bit of a, a riot uh, probably not let's see if we can squeeze them in here Uh, they're not all going to fit. That's all right. They can have two containers. They'll fit in two containers. So I'll sort that out later on. And what else from China? This is from China. Ah, uh, yes. Sanding sticks. So these are uh, just uh, to go with the, the abrasive theme. These are just uh, sanding sticks. They've got an uh, abrasive on the tip. And you can use it to sand stuff. So, yes, very nice. Sanding sticks, well done. I'll have to find a, a place to keep those. That won't be hard. More from China. Here we go. Ah, uh, yes. Um, I, uh, I ordered uh, some of these recently. And when they arrived, I thought they were great. So I got myself some backup ones um, while I was while well, there was a sale on, so I stocked up. Um, yeah, right. So uh, I might as well show you uh, what we can do with them. I think uh, a spare card there. So let's do uh, one of each. I don't know if they, I don't know if they sent me. Oh, this is brush, and this is medium, medium. I'm going to pop them all out. Let's have a look at the whole lot. So, uh, let's see, can we get that out? Yes, we can. All right. Uh, gold. This is metallic medium metallic medium so that they seem to be the same uh, in each uh, pack two of the same uh, these are metallic medium metallic medium 
I, uh, I, I, uh, I, I tried both. There's two, there's two types. As well as there being two colours, there's two types. One of them's a brush and one of them's a hard pen. They call it a hard pen. And uh, I prefer the hard pen. Uh, so... <sighs> Um, that's why they all say metallic medium because uh, I tried to get the hard pen because that's the one I think I prefer. You know, I saw Adrian Black from Adrian's Digital Basement um, uh, using uh, a silver pen when he was writing on his uh, components. And I thought, uh, I think these have come out of a different batch because the color is not the same, the size isn't the same. Oh no, this, this is metallic brush, there you go. So we've got metallic brush, and then we've got metallic hard. So you can actually tell the difference just from the, uh, the, the container that the pens are in. I didn't get any more gold brushes by the looks of it. Um, just a silver brush. Um, and I think that was because I already had gold brush. You know, I got that last time and I wasn't able to get the silver, so I you know, just for the sake of symmetry, um, had another go at it. Got got myself these uh, brush ones. I'll show you the brush ones as well. Uh, almost there on these packets. So just pulling them all out. Um, I do have a couple of uh, spare um, containers for these things, so that shouldn't be a problem. <coughs> all right. So, let's show you the uh, silver, probably works better on something dark, but that's it there, you can see it's uh, shiny. So this is uh, what they call medium metallic, um, and it's, uh, it's, uh, it's what also what they call the hard brush, and this is the brush brush, and I don't know if you can tell, but that's a lot more like a paint brush, uh, the application, it's just not quite as precise a font. And then let's give this one. Hi, I'm gold. So that's what it looks like with the gold pen. Um, yes, so that's everything to tell you about those. I don't know if I'll be able to fit them all in a uh, uh, jar. What have we got over here? My paintbrushes. Uh, they won't fit in with the paintbrushes. <sighs> be good if I had one spare. I think maybe I do have a spare. Give me a sec, I'll be back. I'm back and I found a spare uh, um, pen holder, which is just what the doctor ordered. So uh, that's great. I'll be able to find those uh, brushes if I need them and the rest are uh, hard pens, that's excellent. And uh, I might as well just throw uh, these uh, sanding sticks in this one as well. So we'll have some pens and some sanding sticks together. Nearly at the end here, just three more parcels. So this is, what is this? It's got a, it's got a sticker over the top of it. Let's have a look. What have we got in here? Ah, uh, yes, sanding sticks. So uh, these humble little guys um, are for attaching sandpaper to, um, so that you can, uh, you can sand things. That's what that's all they're for. They're, you, you, you get them and you cut out the bit of sandpaper that you want to use and you stick it on here and then you sand, 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 sand. Oh, look, it's got a... Oh, there you go. And you, you can, uh, <laughs> after you've set it up, you can label it with the grit. So it's got 180 grit through uh, 2500 grit. There you go. So these are little stickers to put on the end to let you know what grit you've got on your little things. So these were cheap and I thought I'd check them out. I think I might have some sandpaper floating around, I don't know. But you need to BYO your sandpaper for these things. They're, uh, they're, they're not actually a full, a full functional set. Um, so uh, I have to think about where I keep those stickers. Um, probably not really gonna use them. And these little things, uh, the best place for them is the plastic sponges box. So I've got a bunch of little plastic doodads for doing things. These are my plastic sponges. So these guys can live in there. 
and we'll all be very organized and happy. Uh, two more things to go. So here's another parcel from China. <clears throat> yes, what do we got here? We don't know yet. Uh, scissors. <sighs> don't want to cut whatsoever, whatever's in there. <clears throat> Although all of the stuff was just cheap stuff. I got it because there was a sale on it, AliExpress. Ah, there we go, more of the same by the looks of it. So these are just more of what we just saw. Um, there we go, yep, they're exactly the same. It's just a set of three, uh, small, medium and large, uh, extra set of stickers. So I'm gonna have a bunch of stickers left over. <sighs> And the same within here as well, just more of those little tools. So that's all well and good. I'll just put those away just like I did with the other ones. Stickers can stay up the back here for now. All right, and then one last thing and we're done. Oop, drop something. Ah yes, this was a sanding thing. I think there was a, a, an abra abrasive theme, wasn't there, for, for, for these? Oh, it's a three pack. I, I didn't know. I, I thought I was buying one. So I got three. Happy, happy days. Uh, I think they're all the same. Um, and they're just, uh, they're just abrasive um, rotary bits. Uh, so just, uh, that's a, that's a uh, Velcro. Yeah, excellent. Okay, cool. So, uh, oh, look, it tells you the RPM. <sighs> So it recommends to run it at 15k, 15,000 RPM. So yeah, they, they are the same, I can confirm. That's all just the same, same, same. Uh, and it looks like this will just screw on uh, this way. Very good. And screw that on. And then we've got uh, a, a little abrasive thing. So. Uh, <coughs> Yeah, cool. And that's it, that's the mail call for today. So I'll, I'll just throw you over to the farewell cam and we'll wrap up. So that was it, just some doodads from China and, and Amazon. And uh, I think uh, the, the, my favorite thing was, was easily the, uh, <laughs> the, the um, uh, circuit boards from Electro Cookie. Good work, Electro Cookie. I'm a huge fan, so I'm very pleased to have these circuit boards. I got heaps of them, so I should be able to use them without having to worry about running out. Um, yeah, excellent, good find. I'll, I'll put a link to all of this stuff in the uh, in the show notes. So uh, check out Electro Cookie if you're looking for some good uh, perf board um, for your projects, proto board, whatever you want to call it. Um, and the least favorite. I suppose the least favorite things were just these silly little sanding sticks that I got. I mean, they're they they they're probably when you want when you need them, you'll be happy to have them. Um, and they can be used for all sorts of other little you know doodaddy things. So little plastic doodads, I always have to have some plastic doodads. So, but you know, I was pretty happy really with everything in here. The uh, sanding sticks, these are great, and they don't need uh, any extra attachments. Uh, plenty of uh, of pens for writing on. Uh, on uh, equipment, so that was good. Uh, more rotary bits, yeah, I'm, I'm happy. So uh, uh, I'll have to uh, put those new nylon rotary things in two drawers, but that's no problem because I, I got these uh, orange ones recently, and that's picked up a lot of slack from over on that side of the room, which is good. So I've got plenty of spare drawers over there at the moment. Uh, anyway, that concludes today's mail call. Uh, just some stuff. Uh, some doodads. Um, I will have more videos coming out soon. I've got mini projects to do. I'm looking forward to that. I'm still working through the Maxitronics projects, so more of that on the way. I've got a bunch of ad hoc projects that I'll be doing on the main show. Looking forward to doing a couple of uh, book teardowns. I've got some old books. I've got some new books. So there's all sorts of stuff to be done. Um, 
but you know, I'm busy with day job as well at the moment. So, uh, um, yeah, th th there'll be more videos coming out soon. Eh? Particularly, I'm going to, I'm looking forward to getting the, uh, uh, the, the, the video for the debugging of the symbol keyboard, the first mini project. So stand by for that. That'll be coming out soon. Anyway, uh, thanks very much for watching and please remember to hit like and subscribe.